Hey folks, smoking Hads here. So just uh, a quick video on a good farming spot. I don't know if anybody's heard of it or they haven't, but I'm just sharing it. Might get patched, nerfed. I don't even know if you can or can't do this, so take this advice at your own peril. But with that said, let me just show you where this is. So basically, this is the dungeon ruins of Eridu. And it is at this waypoint in the south. Um, it is directly south of Kovish, Kiova Shad, as you can see there. And you just basically, yep, this is like a really good dungeon to uh, get your farming on, get your loot on for drops. I'm currently, I'm just going to do a quick uh, run through the dungeon because I need footage of my build anyway. But I'm currently running this dungeon to try and get the Howl from the Lobots. I'm trying to finish my build. I'm basically not even looking at loot. Um, it's dropping. I'm just looking for the symbols that come up. The uniques have like a symbol that come up on the radar like that there. Is a legend. But the uniques would have like a, a symbol. I think that's right enough, yeah. Was it first? Sometimes you want the uh, Curse Shrines, there's always Shrines in here. And a lot, lots, lots of elites. And then, yep, you get this mechanic here, whereby it can just throw enemies on top of you. And they're usually elites as well. So again, more chances for drops. And again, we just keep moving. So the first part is just slay all enemies. So you do want to... You're killing as many of these as you move along. Don't leave any stragglers. I, need more time. I think it helps with the enemies being thrown on top of you as well. So the more you kill, and then if you're running around, there's a chance of sort of them on top. Now, um, you, could, you could try and get nightmare sigils for this, I guess. Um, and get the mob density bigger. I don't know if it does that or if it increases your chances. But I'm just running this normal. You can just run this normal. Um, if, I mean, if it's just legendaries you're looking for, then you will find them in here. I'm looking for uniques. I've got like, there's another legendary drop, but it's not a unique, I don't think. I don't think the stars can be unique. I think they have their own symbol at sync. Really. I've been running it so much, it would be so great. I could just drop the unique while I was running. But this is another, I mean, if you're just looking for gold, if you're looking to just get items dropped from enemies to go sell or salvage, again, a really, really great place to run because it's just really compact. Quick and easy. And depending on how quick your build is, how good you are at AOE, you could probably determine how quick you can get through it. There's more enemies. Again, and it's kind of weak. So loot, lots of goodies, I need more time. and we're on to the next area already. So the first area, as you can see, um, slay all enemies, it loops round. It's just two loops, and you just want to go around and kill everything. The next area is two specific enemies need to be killed. There's usually an event area as well that you can stumble upon. I need more time. Um, and that makes up the basis of this area. This area is not slay all enemies. So I don't tend to focus as much, but as you can see, there's still lots of elites to kill. I'm not ready yet. I'm low on oh wait, there's still a... Can see. I'm just ignoring most of the items for now. I'm just farming. I'm 
literally just looking for those uniques. Um, I will pick up legendaries. I see them. I will make a video um, with the build that I'm using for farms as well. After I'm gonna, this is literally going to be the footage for it. See any unique, so we just move on. I need more time. I got the utility shrine still active there. I'm not ready yet. Almost better dust there. That's one of the enemies down. We're just trying to do this as fast as we can. Essentially. Take our time here because it's the fiery ones. I hate those uh, elites. As you can see, veiled crystals dropping all the time. All that good stuff that you're after. Didn't drop anything we're after, so again, we just move on. And as you can see, the this is the boss area has opened up now. And there's that mechanic again, although this time I've noticed that um, in the second area, elites don't tend to be dropped on you. This only seems to be in the first area. And again, more. Again, build crystals and gold. Uh, there's sometimes elites round here. I need time to do that. So always check round here as well. Yep, and as you can see, there's a bit of them here. So we'll just quickly deal with them. I'm not ready yet. I'll just keep using my potions because I'll get this. And then we take that. And then it's boss time. I need time to do that. As you can see, depending on the kind of build you've got, depends how quickly you can do it. And it's done. Now you don't have to kill the boss, but I tend to do it just for another chance at a an elite drop, a unique. I'm trying to get uniques, and then if you want to rinse repeat this dungeon, the you need to leave the dungeon first. Just remember that you need to leave first. This will be the the cycle that you'll go through. You will leave the dungeon. You will come into your game. You will leave game. You will restart. Back into the character. And then back into the dungeon. And it should be reset when you do that. And you can just run repeat it over. As you've seen, there's a lot of elites in there. A lot of grouped up enemies. It's a very short dungeon. It loops around quite easily. So, it, you know, it's not um, back and forth. I had been running Champion's Demise. But I found this a lot more effective. But I'm still looking for that unique and then again you can just run straight back into the dungeon so yeah just a quick video in regards to where i'm farming um right now where i'm leveling and uh, until i get the unique i'm after and then once i get it i'll move on to different content as well so yeah i will post the build um that i'm using for this farm next um so yeah look out for that thanks for watching and i hope to see you next time goodbye